All right. So I'm going to be demonstrating how to create an alias for SQL Server instance. My name is Ade. My friends call me Ade is a DBA. So I have an instance here that I'm connected to, which, whose name is VM01. And this um, SQL Server is a 2017 version, uh, developer edition. So I want to create an alias for this instance so that I don't have to connect uh, with this name. So to do that, I'm going to pull up my configuration manager, which is this one right here. So on the, on the left pane on the configuration manager, I'll go to the SQL native client, this one right here. So there are actually two places where you can create the alias. Uh, here and here, but I'm going to be using just this one. This one would suffice. So where you have the aliases, um, but first you need to know what port your SQL Server is listening on. The default is 1433, but it may have been changed. So to confirm what port, you can go to the SQL Server network configuration, which is this one. You see the protocols for MS SQL Server. And this shows that this is a default instance. So double click on the TCP IP, this pops up, go to IP addresses and scroll all the way down. And this is the part that we are using, 1433. It has not been changed from the default. So I'll go back to the alias on the native client here, right here. All right, click, new alias. So you can give it whatever name you want. So I would use server 01, but you can use any name. And then the part, which is 1433 that we just confirmed. And what server are we giving an alias? The VM01. This is the actual name. So we are trying to create an alias for it. So after this, just click apply, click OK. And then come to your uh, management studio and connect. So instead of connecting as VM01, which is the actual name, I can connect with the alias which is server zero one. Hit connect and bam. So this is how you create an alias. So now, for example, let's say you're at work and how do you know if you are connected or let's say you're given the name of a server or an instance to connect to, how do you differentiate if it's the actual name or the alias? This is how to know that. So I have two instances here. This one is the actual name. This is the alias, but let's say we didn't know this before now. How do we confirm which is the actual and which is the alias? So I'm going to open a query window on both instances. So the first one, I'll open this query window. Apologies, my management studio is slow. All right, so on this query window, I'm going to run select at at server name and I'll execute and then here whatever this gives you whatever the result of this query this is the actual name of the instance and if the actual name of the instance matches what you have on the object explorer then that means you are, you are connected with the actual name okay so now I'm going to go to the other instance here which is this one or the other connection and I'm going to open another query window. I'll run the same query at, at server name. And I'll execute. 